Hi folks, it's Jody with Spectrum Wisdom Tarot, here to do a random reading for the 9th of March. These are general readings, like I always say, you know, if they resonate with you, that's great, and if they don't, maybe next time. Thank you for everyone who has liked, subscribed, shared to my channel. You guys rock! And if anyone would like a personal reading with me, all the info is in the box below. Um, I do readings within a 24-hour period of contact, whether you contact me through email or give me a phone call. And readings are done in a private video sent to you by email, or they're done over the phone. The cost is the same no matter how you want to do it. So again, give me a shout. And if you want to learn tarot, I do have tarot card classes. There are five videos plus a bonus video, and I coach throughout the whole thing. So if you ever get stuck, you can give me a shout. I'll be there to help. Okay, let's see what's shaking. Hmm. We have something that has not been completed. The world card in reverse. In the upright, it would be about wrapping things up, something coming to a close. But we are in Mercury retrograde, so... Things come back to be completed. Hmm. Wow, then we have Temperance. This is a Sagittarius card. You know, about balance, patience. Hmm. Maybe it takes, you know, somebody balance, getting their head and their heart on the same page in order to finally wrap something up that needs to be completed. Hmm. Ooh, that one just came flying out. We have the Four of Pentacles. Now, some people say it's a miser card. But this is somebody holding on or holding back. Not speaking their mind. Not speaking, you know, giving their opinion. And maybe that's what needs to be said. Maybe somebody didn't before a situation comes back around. And they can finally say something that needed to be said before. Hmm. Could be with a fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Or somebody with these properties. But he's a messenger, first and foremost. He's a messenger to take a course of action. To move on something. And not stay silent about it. Hmm. Could be with an Earth-like person, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or somebody who has these properties. Somebody who is grounded, practical, methodical. They're realists. They don't sugarcoat anything. They like to have material things. Hmm. So maybe something needs to be wrapped up with a uh, excuse me, a Earth-like person. Or an Earth-like person needs to wrap something up. Bring something to a completion. Full circle. And when they do this, they have to stay balanced. You know, they can't be emotionally distraught. They can't be mentally, you know, scattered. They need to have it all together. Because it might be coming quicker than someone thinks. You get the tower. And it's going to be right under the world card. Now this is something that comes out of left field. You never see it coming. Something might come back to be completed. Quicker than somebody anticipates. And they need to be ready. And, you know, the temperance card, balanced. Because it might come to a shock to somebody. It's going to take action. Someone to move on something. To bring something to an end. But somebody's not working on it. You get the Eight of Pentacles in reverse. In the upright, this could be learning a skill, a craft. It could be working on themselves to be the best person they can be. But somebody's not putting an effort into this. And now you get the Nine of Swords, too. Sleepless nights, agony, thinking about something over and over and over again. It's anxiety, it's worry, and it's right under the 
Four of Pentacles. <clears throat> Somebody might have had to complete something and they didn't. Or they couldn't wrap up something because they weren't balanced. A situation before, possibly with an Earth like person, an Earth sign. And something's going to come back quicker than they thought. Something that they didn't work on. But when it comes back around, this situation, something needs to be buttoned up. Because I didn't give it any effort before. Now they're worried about it. They're not telling anybody. They're, not, they're keeping it to, them, to themselves. But they're worried. Hmm. Could be about an offer that wasn't made. You get the Knight of Cups right under the Knight of Wands. And in the upright, this could be a message of something heartfelt, something sentimental. Could be from a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. But no offer made. Hmm. I wonder if somebody was expecting an offer from somebody. And then all of a sudden reality hits that somebody made no effort whatsoever to offer something. And now somebody is in their head about it. <coughs> Excuse me. This person might have found out that there was no, or wasn't going to be any offer. That something wasn't going to go any further. Regardless. It's going to take this tower moment, I think, to make somebody realize that nobody's putting effort into whatever the situation is. Because there's no happiness coming out of it. Ten of Cups. And it's right under the King of Pentacles. I think somebody's going to get a hard reality here. Probably about somebody about the past. Six of Cups. Nostalgia. Finally thinking about the past. Memories. Hmm. So I think that's something that Never had a conclusion. It's going to take somebody some balance. And it's, this person is not saying anything. But there's a course of action to take. You know, with this earth energy here. Reality comes in really quick. And now somebody's worried about it. Maybe they didn't give any effort into it before. Whoa, let's get into it. So we have some sort of cycle that has not been completed. It, not, it hasn't had a proper ending. Could be with a Sagittarius. This situation calls for balance. For someone to have their head and their heart on the same page here. And it's about patience. Somebody could have been waiting. Just sitting, waiting. Waiting maybe for a situation to come back to them. It could have been with a fire sign, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, or somebody who takes on those properties. But now there's going to be a message coming in about taking a course of action to do something about this, to move on it. It could have something to do with an Earth-like person, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, or somebody who takes on these qualities. But the waiting, I think, is over because something's going to come in. Information. Something's going to blow their mind. And maybe this person gives up working on the situation. And now they're stuck in their head. Worrying about it. Thinking about it over and over and over again. Why an offer wasn't made. And because of this, it stole somebody's happiness. It stole the opportunity to ride unicorns. 
And I do believe it has everything to do with something or someone from the past. Wow. So let's break this one down, folks. There's a big reality check about something that was not completed. Somebody stopped putting the work into the situation. Maybe so they can find balance. And somebody's not saying anything, but it bothers them. They think about it over and over again, why they didn't get this, this completion. Why nobody took a course of action to offer something. And why this person still hasn't found their happiness after this. It could have something to do with the past. Somebody staying in the past and not moving on from it. Just moving on from whatever this is. Giving themselves closure. They will be able to find their happiness again. I think somebody's going to let it go. So, that is what I have for you. Please keep on liking, subscribing, sharing to my channel. And I'll see everybody back here real soon. Take care.